Charles the pig has quite a tale to tell. And today, it's a happy one. It's been a long three weeks. Rob Holmes and his family visited their pet pig daily here at the UT Veterinary Medical Center. He loves the belly rub. Get a belly rub. <laughs> After three weeks of intense treatment. Are you ready to go home, buddy? Charles Hi, buddy. gets to go with them. I'm so excited. <laughs> I cannot wait to get him home in his new pen. Take care. Yep. See you, Charles. To fully appreciate his survival, the Holmes took us to what's left of their home, which they fled with minutes to spare. It's survival at that point. Unable to drive over trees and power lines downed in the wind, they ran to a neighbor's waiting vehicle and had to leave Charles behind. This is where he was when the fire hit. And was, how did he get out? Only he knows. A neighbor found him the next day near the bottom of the home's driveway, alive and burrowed into the mud. This is where Charles made it through the fire. And you can see how he rid of the mud and ran around. Even the stump was on fire and he still managed to survive in that spot. Does that amaze you? It's a miracle. There's, there's no other way to explain that. I mean, take a look around, there's nothing left. That's, that's the Lord had something to do with this. He had to. Finally. Oh, there you go. Come on. Oh. At Grandma's house where they're staying, the Holmes welcomed Charles home. It's so good to have you back. With a telltale sign that he's happy too. He's a strong, strong pig. He's definitely given everybody a lot of inspiration and hope. In Gatlinburg, Becca Hobbiger. This is probably the best Christmas present we could ever have. WBIR 10 News.